Hi, I'm Tammy Sadler with Carolina Biological Supply Company. We often get questions from our customers regarding what type of packaging to choose when ordering preserved specimens. The type of packaging you choose is important, not only for receiving the specimens, but also for storing them over an extended period of time. I will take you through some of the choices available so that you can make the best decision for your classroom or lab. If you're teaching a dissection activity over several classroom or lab sessions, it's important to consider specimen storage to keep them as fresh as possible. Carolina provides two types of specimen packaging, vacuum sealed bags and pail packaging. Vacuum packed specimens are supplied in vacuum sealed triple layered plastic barrier bags. The specimens may be packaged one per bag or many per bag in what's called a bulk bag. Pail pack specimens are ideal for long term storage as the specimens are fully immersed in preservation fluid. The specimens are available in one to five gallon pails sealed with leak proof reusable lids. To decide which packaging is best for you, you need to determine how long you'll be storing your specimens. Our packaging offers you the flexibility to store the unopened specimens for days, weeks, months, and even years. All of our specimens are designed to last indefinitely when unopened in the original packaging and come with a 100% satisfaction guarantee. You'll also need to consider shipping options when deciding on the packaging that is right for you, remembering that pails weigh more than bulk bags. If you plan on using your specimens immediately or within a few months, we recommend using vacuum packed bags. Once opened, these specimens will last for weeks or even a few months. Vacuum packing is ideal for short term storage solutions. The bags are easy to open, enabling easy distribution of the specimens. Another benefit is that any unopened specimens can easily be stored for future use. I'm putting on my personal protective equipment now. Remember to always model good safety practices. There are two options for vacuum packaging, one per bag or bulk bags. One per bag packaging is ideal for convenience. The bags are easy to open and can be easily distributed to students. Bulk bagged packaging is great for teachers who would like to use multiple specimens at once. It also offers a quantity pricing benefit. Once you're ready to store your vacuum packed specimens, it's easy to prepare them. To ensure that your specimens remain moist for future sessions, we recommend using our wetting solution before packing the specimens away. The wetting solution helps to maintain moisture, reduce dehydration, and keep tissue pliable and easy to work with. After you have sprayed the specimen, return it to its original shipping bag and place the bag in another resealable bag. We find it useful to use binder clips to ensure that the bag remains closed. This double bagging method helps keep the specimen fresh. All of Carolina's vacuum packed bags come with another resealable bag for easy storage. Oftentimes, larger specimens packed in single bags or bulk bags will have fluid that will start to drain from the specimen and pool in the corner of the bag over time. This is normal and will not hurt the specimen. In fact, this fluid helps keep the specimen fresh during storage. It's important to keep your specimens no higher than room temperature and out of direct sunlight. Refrigeration is not necessary. If you plan to use the specimens over a longer period of time, such as many months or years, we recommend you use pail packaging. This is especially helpful for teachers who plan to use the specimens over multiple semesters. Pail packed specimens are ideal for long term storage because they are kept immersed in holding fluid. They are also easy to store and come with leak proof reusable lids. Our pails are sealed tightly to prevent leaks during shipping, but with the right tool, the Carolina Pail Opener, opening them is simple. You only need to apply a little pressure with the pail opener to open the pail. Slowly work your way around the rim, sometimes as many as two to three times, and pry the lid up. We can ship various specimens in the pails, and they come in convenient one to five gallon sizes depending on your dissection needs. When you're ready to return the specimen to the pail for storage, make sure there's enough fluid to cover all the specimens. Please contact us if you need more fluid for your pail. Our fluids are proprietary, and we can help you in getting more. You can use the pail opener as a hammer to close the lid 
and make sure it is sealed properly. Ensure your storage area is not in direct sunlight and is kept at least room temperature. The specimens can retain their tissue quality for many years if kept in the right conditions. If you have any other questions about how to store or care for your preserved specimens, Carolina has experts that can assist you. Just call us at 800-334-5551 or email us at customer underscore service at carolina.com. And remember, all of our specimens are 100% satisfaction guaranteed. Visit us at carolina.com slash preserved to see our complete selection of preserved specimens, dissection tools, and classroom kits.